Hey guys, welcome to the Lunch Time Review. Today I'm going to try one of these uh, Hormel Black Label Oven Baked Egg Bites. This one is the egg, sausage, and bacon with three cheese. Um, looks pretty good. I mean, you can see it's got some good char on it. Um, ready in 60 seconds. So we bought these at Kroger. They were $2.99 at Kroger, which isn't too bad. Um, they are in uh, the refrigerated section, not in the frozen section. Um, let's see. They were... They're 260 calories for one whole package. So 260, not too awfully bad. Um, there's all the information. I don't know if that, how well that's focused, but there it is. Yeah, there it goes. So heating directions are on the front. This one, the package is 4.2 ounces or 119 grams. What you're going to do is remove the outer plastic package. Microwave eggs in the paper tray for 60 seconds. Let stand um, one... Or as I say, three minutes. I really can't tell. One minute. Let's stand one minute if desired and enjoy. So you remove the whole, basically you remove all this plastic packaging. I wonder if it has a little tab where I can grab it and pull it. Yep. Let's see what they look like. And then I'll stick them on a paper plate and I'll put them in the microwave. Yeah, there they are. So they got a little tray. You can pull this out. Microwave in this tray. And um, put it in the microwave for the... 60 seconds and then you can let them sit. I'll probably just bring them back over and show you to you once they come out. So I'll be right back. All right, so here it is out of the microwave. I didn't do anything to it yet. I just carried it over here literally, but I want to take it and take it out and cut it in half for you so you can see it. Um, I like that it's got a little like um, browning around it. See, it's like it's got some some browning around there, which really makes the flavor come out. Brown Things that are browned up uh, really just develops flavor. So there's the inside of what they look like. So I'm going to let these probably not cool off for any time, but I'm going to take them over the table and then set the camera. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm going to try out a bite um, where I cut. I did get a fork just so like it easier to try for video. So that's what I'm going to take. It's got bacon and all kinds of stuff in it. I didn't look to see what the cheese is for. The main ingredient is eggs, which is good. The second ingredient, it's cottage cheese. That's interesting. I'm, I wouldn't have thought cottage cheese would be in there. Maybe it's just as a thickener. There's a lot of stuff in cottage cheese. Wow. Um, trying to get to the next bit. Then cooked pork sausage. And then um, Monterey Jack cheeses. And then water, cream cheddar cheese butter that's it so i didn't know cottage cheese was actually considered a cheese but three cheese whatever um i like the flavor of the bacon the bacon really is what the main flavor i got i do like that kind of buttery eggy uh, scrambled egg kind of flavor if you've ever put um, scrambled eggs with like um, with cooked them in butter that's kind of the flavor you get it, it's really really good and like I said that caramelized edge that brown edge right here really adds a lot of flavor um, to the eggs themselves that's really really good I do get I get the flavor of the eggs primarily the bacon, when you get a bite of bacon, that's pretty much all you taste is that smoky bacon flavor. Um, you do get the cheese flavor somewhat, although it's a, it's the mixture of cheese, so you don't know what cheese is standing out, but you do get cheese. Um, I don't really get the sausage, though, and I've, I've hit a couple pieces of sausage. Like, here's a piece right here. Let me try it by itself. It's a lighter flavored sausage, so the bacon actually stands out more than the sausage does. The sausage doesn't have a lot of those... Um, really strong spices and seasonings in them. So it's a very, it's a very mild sausage. I mean like super mild sausage. So if you don't like something that's really spicy, I think you'd be fine with this. This is, there's no spices in there. Actually, I bet you some people would like these with some hot sauce put on top of them. Cause I know a lot of people eat eggs and hot sauce. Um, hot sauce would go really good with this. I like them the way they are. I think they're really good. They're not a spectacular meal or nothing. You're going to go, wow, this is the best thing I ever ate. However, the flavors are really good. It has a good egg flavor. It has a good cheese flavor. It has a good bacon flavor. The sausage, and eh, not so much, but but it's good. Um, but again, it's not going to wow you. 
For that reason, I'm gonna give it like a, I'm gonna give it a three and a half. It's above average. I do like the textures of them. You get quite a bit for the calories and the money, so I don't, I don't think that's too bad. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna give it like a three and a half, not quite a four. If the sausage has been a little spicier, I probably would have given it more of a four, but, um, but yeah, I'm gonna keep it a three and a half just because of the sausage. So I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.